John Steen Hussein re-elected as leader of South Africa's main opposition party, Democratic Alliance. The Democratic Alliance has re-elected John Steen Hussein as its leader, putting him in a strong position as the party campaigns to unseat the ruling African National Congress in South Africa's national elections next year. Steen Hussein won 83% of the vote at the party's National Congress in Johannesburg, defeating Mafo Feleste, who would have been only the second black leader in the party's history. The DA has historically appealed to a predominantly white demographic. Steen Hussein has made preventing an ANC Economic Freedom Fighters coalition his top priority in the months leading up to the elections. The DA has struggled to manage coalitions in the past and has had all three of its mayoral candidates ousted since 2021. Steen Hussein plans to lead a pre-election united opposition, Moonshot Pack, consisting of opposition parties and civic organizations. The DA was formed in 2003 after breaking away from parties that were part of the apartheid government. It became the official opposition following the 2004 general elections and grew in support until 2019 when it suffered from its first decline in a national election under the leadership of Musi Maimen, its first black leader. Despite this setback, the party has maintained control of the Western Cape province and won mayoral positions in three key cities across South Africa in the 2021 local government elections through coalition governments. During the 2021 elections, the ruling ANC fell below the 50% threshold for the first time in democratic history, while the DA won 20% of the vote, losing votes to the EFF. The ANC has faced criticism for corruption and mismanagement, which has contributed to its declining support.